Hi, I'm Austin. I'm Dan. And we're here to play games. Badly. Yes, welcome back to Persona 3 Reload. Last episode was a bit intense. So if you're still recovering, I completely understand. Uh, mm -hmm. We learned a lot about Ken and his past, as well as Aragaki Shijiro. And uh, major events yeah. happened. If you are just watching this episode for the first time and are unfamiliar with the game, I do not want to give you any spoilers. So check the top right corner for a link to the full playlist. You can start from episode one. Or if you just want to deal with not knowing anything, or if you're familiar with the game, or if you just want to see us and see what we're about. Stick around, find out. Yeah, you are welcome to be confused. <laughs> That's right. That's right. All right. Uh, so I believe when we last left off, we were working on getting a Sengoku helm, which we've gone through some steps where we talked to him and he's supposed to bring one at a later time. I don't think we got the actual helmet yet. So because uh, we, we talked to the teacher and then we ended up talking to the math teacher the next day. Um, and he was talking about cheese, I think. I don't remember. <laughs> anyway, I think, <laughs> I think where we're at is it's probably because he's so mousy. I don't He was talking about math, but I, he's I've such a mousy slept guy. I've since then, so right. I don't remember at all. So. Right. What I do know is that we're supposed to be continuing our star social link, which is what we're going to do right now. That's right. Yeah. We have the star persona, I believe. So. Yes, yeah. we do. We have... Uh, he's a star-shaped persona kaiwan yeah that's the one mm -hmm. wanna grab some chow oh yeah all right kaiwan let's go yeah oh you're down all right then how about we get some ramen <laughs> since you're already here and all gonna compete again man this is good if i had the money i'd get some for mom oh yeah i forgot to mention I get to eat here for free. Not just here, but every restaurant in the strip mall. They're all supporting me. I'm Dang. the only one who can eat as much as I want, wherever I want. That's awesome. But I feel kind of bad, like I'm taking advantage of their kindness, so sometimes I pay the bill anyway. Someday, I'll pay them back for everything. But for now, I gotta take whatever I can get. That's why I have to make it big. It's for everyone who's been helping me. Sounds, like a, Sounds like a lot of pressure. Yeah, that's that's a genuine response there. Well, mm -hmm. I'd be lying if I said it wasn't. But a little pressure can be a great motivator. All that matters is how you deal with it. By the way, who would you say is your biggest rival? Myself. <laughs> Myself is indeed the correct answer. That's really... I did it again. <laughs> you did. True. You can be your own worst enemy, but... At the same time, your greatest ally. You do get it. Hmm. There isn't really anyone left who I want to compete with. The other guys on my team can't even keep up with me. I guess what I'm looking for is a real challenge. Hey, you should mm. think about taking track more seriously. Then we can really push each other. Might even reach new limits together. Oh, well, that seems a little overrated. <laughs> I mean, Close yeah, he sees their potential. Now we're ranked two. We'll catch each other between training sessions. Later. Bye bye. Bye bye. I see you're back. Sonata. Mm hmm. Okay, so we're going to do request 76. What you guys looking at? The chores? at the board. <laughs> no, they're arguing about chores. That must be what they're doing. Request 76. I don't think I've ever seen him have something for him. That's interesting. Huh. Uh, Shuji Ik Ik Ikutsuki. Shuji Ikutsuki in the lobby. Yes. Yeah. Oh, he would have a glasses wipe. That makes sense. That's why it's there. There you go. Yep. I do have something, of course, but you don't wear glasses. Well, if you're looking for a wipe for eyeglasses, I have a spare. Hang on. Great. Here, it looks dingy, but it works very well in my fact. 
Come on, give me your puns. Oh, and here's a little something extra. Gag glasses. All right, that'll work. <laughs> it's the secret item I was thinking of surprising Aragaki-kun with the next time I saw him. Aw. Surely this would get that stoic face of his to break into laughter. Or, well, that was the plan. <laughs> yeah, no, that's not going to work with Why him. don't you... Yeah, no, right? <laughs> Why don't you take it? I can't. <laughs> you just, like, stare at him and then walk away. <laughs> You're like, hmm, I should go do training. Like, God. <laughs> well, no, Aragaki specifically, not... Yeah, 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 that's true, yeah. It would be of Sonata, but yeah. I'd be happy <laughs> if you could put it to good use. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, Shinjiro would just been like, oh. <laughs> just leave? <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna go teach him cooking. Oh, Shinjiro. I know, right? The wound is still fresh. It is. All right. Good day. Oh, is there something I can assist you with? Are you accepting a request? Wonderful. It seems you've completed a request. One moment, please, while I check. So Ooh, this must be the sort of request. Yeah. That's good. Sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> uh, this is sort of thing one would use to clean a pair of eyeglasses. Fine microfibers, maximum flexibility and absorbency. An ideal size. It's utterly perfect. I see. It wasn't just any old rag after all. Hmm? You brought something else with you. May I see that as well? Oh dear. Oh my. What elegance. Those resemblant of my master. This does leave a different impression. Then let us be <laughs> off. <laughs> That's amazing. Well, what do you think? The mustache makes my nose itch a fair bit though. Not only does it give me a semblance of intelligence, but also one of harmony as well. What a splendid item. Please, take this as your reward. Nice. <laughs> uh, Hierophant Daisoujo. Daisoujo. I will await yeah, Daisoujo a is really of cool. With Regenerate 3, specifically. Mm. Mm -hmm. That makes sense. All Daisoujo right. learns that one. Yeah, we are cooking through these requests. Did you need anything else? No, I'm mm. good for now. Very well, then. Oh, that's funny. So Daisoju learns naturally Growth 3 and Invigorate 3, but not Regenerate 3. So we'd have to put it on him. Yeah, we're going to have to get a card for it or find that the, or from the fusion, yeah. 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 You guys okay? I mean, like, there's a lot of you already. We just cleared a boss. They're grumbling. Grumble, grumble. All right, anyway, what are we doing? Grumble, grumble. We are playing Persona 3 Reload. No, Thank just you. kidding. We are... Uh, Okay, yeah, go back to the lobby, and we're going to use the PC. Ooh, right. Use some of our new software. Mm-hmm. This is a good one. Time to share on the shared, shared computer. We're going to do Veggie Farmer Sim. Oh, perfect. <laughs> to increase the yield of your vegetable garden, I'm going to go with Stardew Valley. Looks like a game that simulates raising crops. Plants don't need love. They need appropriate amounts of nutrients and water. A knowledgeable seeming dwarf is giving a lecture on agriculture. To follow their instructions and adjust the water and fertilizer. I was able to produce a bountiful harvest. I feel like I learned something tangible about growing vegetables. The amount of crops you can harvest from the rooftop plants has increased. Heck yeah. Honestly, if it's a dwarf giving the advice, it makes me think of the animal, uh, animal, wow. The anime, <laughs> Delicious in Dungeon, which, if you haven't watched it, it's ridiculous. Hey, Austin. Watch it. Yeah. Hey, Austin, have you watched any good animals lately? Uh, well, I watch my cat sleep <laughs> on my bed regularly, which is, you know, cute. Yeah, it is adorable. So, yes, Sleepy as a matter of fact, I have. <laughs> Come at me! All right. <laughs> you want to go, bro? Let's go. Let's go. Yeah. All right. So go back to the faculty office. First floor. Oh, We're yeah. going to try to get the helmet again. Yeah. <laughs> Mr. Ono seems to have stepped out again. Hmm. The main ingredients are D-glucose, erythritol, saccharin, sodium. These are all sweeteners. Oh, Yuki. One moment, please. Take a look at this. Mind hmm. supplement. Supplement the mind. I ordered a bag of sand through the mail the other day, and it came with a supplement. It says here that this will boost your brain power. I don't know how they could make such an outlandish claim with these ingredients. 
See for yourself, the active ingredients is in this are all sweeteners. At the very end, it lists an omega-3 fatty acid called DHA, but that means there's only trace amounts of it. I know it was free, but what a joke. Maybe I'm in the wrong line of work. Take this. Go ahead and take it with you if you want, but the best it'll do is be a placebo. <laughs> the food they serve at Wakatsuku has better benefits than that. Made with loads of fish eyes, a prime source of DHA. It's not my thing, though. Speaking of DHA, did you know the full term is... Oh boy. Uh, Dacosahexaonic acid. Yep. No, hexanoic acid. I was close. Dacosahexaonic acid, yes. Yeah, I was very close. Anyway, you yeah, see... Very it's... close. I learned about DHA. <laughs> Knowing my wife, she would have looked at that and been like, oh yeah, it's this, and spit it out like it's nothing. That's true. <laughs> she uh, pronounces things better than both of us. Yes, she is, has an inherent <laughs> skill at pronouncing things that I do not have. Indeed. Mr. Ono doesn't seem to be returning. I decided to give up for today. We learning, we're learning cool stuff, though. We are. We've learned quite a lot of cool things, especially about tarot and numerology. Yeah, numerology is so cool. Mm, that was right. tarot. Okay, uh, now that we've dealt with that, uh, we're going to go rank up Hierophant. Boon no, yeah, Boonkichi. Boonkichi! Alright! Oh wait, let's double check. Do we... Yeah. Persona, because we can do yeah. all those... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, we right. don't have a... That's fine. <laughs> we'll go get one, yeah. Yep. If I can remember what buttons do what. That's hard. It is. It's very difficult. Alright, let's go in here. Because last time we also fused a bunch of Persona. Because I had a full list. I've yep, been not for you. What up? Oh my. Uh, only just halfway. Wow. Your hard work for, uh, to show my appreciation for all your hard work, cost to summon a Persona from the Compendium will be discounted even further. I hope to make good use of it. How may I assist you? Now then. Cool. I'm always down with the discounted summon rate. This is your progress so far. All right. Arcana. Need a hierophant. Uh. Does that persona catch your eye? Please take a one. look. Yeah, why not? So you'll be summoning this one. Very well. It's yours. Cool. Very well. Let me. We look All right. Now we can go hang out with Bunkichi. Yeah. Pal map. Iwatodam strip mall. Do you suppose they call it a strip mall because there is a strip of stores? Nah, that's too easy. <laughs> Sounds wrong. <laughs> yep. Completely out of whack. Mm-hmm. Oh! Welcome! Uh. Okay, what happened? <laughs> Are you fighting again? <laughs> Mom, Dad. Oh, don't you worry. She's, she's crying because she's happy. What? She's an emotional woman, bless her heart. She's been like this since the day we met. You see, all the graduates from my son's class have come together. They're collecting signatures to save the persimmon tree. Oh. They say the tree is a memorial to their former teacher. They don't want it to be cut down. That's great, right? <laughs> yeah, say that's great. <laughs> it was the same for our son's funeral. Many of them showed up for it. It's been so many years since then, but they still remember him. They've given their precious time for our son. I, I don't know what to say. I'm so grateful. You must be the one who called on them for this, right? What are you talking about? <laughs> ah, don't pretend it's just us. You don't have to be so modest. 
You're a samurai. A modern day samurai. Oh, really? What are you talking about? <laughs> two, <laughs> what is he saying? <laughs> yep, the two seem to think I'm responsible for the petition. They're showing considerable gratitude. I feel like we're growing closer. Yeah, I'm glad that Persimmon's being saved. It's a cool tree. And before you know it, you'll graduate and step boldly into adulthood. Don't forget about us, you hear? Someday I'd love to grab a drink, you and me. Well, you'll have to but take it up now, with the you'll monk. You'll have to make do with this. Seal the mist. Here, have some Sprite. See you again soon. Have a starry. Started with the elderly couple and went back to the dorm. A starry, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Every time I see starry, I think it's I think of Pokemon. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Oh. Pokemon? Pokemon. Midterms will be starting next week. Oh right. To be honest, I'm not sure how productive anyone will be trying to anyone will be trying to study on their own. Well, that aside, try to do your best to study as well, but don't push yourself. Oh, we're gonna push ourselves. We're gonna get a study group going with Mitsuru and Sonata. Excellent. Are you gonna try to like uh, hold yourself off the chair the whole time again? I <laughs> go. Mm. Where he was doing like the air sit. The air feels kind of heavy. Yeah, that was. <laughs> oh, it's you. He's training. Right. Sorry, I was just thinking about something. Would it be Shinjiro? Because that would make sense. You guys should take a break. Should I invite them to study for a change of pace? Mm -hmm. Sure. I think you have something to say. Do you need something? Let's study mm -hmm. together. Oh, right. Exams are coming up soon. Time marches on without a care in the world, huh? Hmm. An invitation to study from Yuki is uncommon. Let's take him up with the offer. What are you trying to say? Akihiko, regarding mathematical proofs, how would you approach this one? Trigonometry, huh? <laughs> this is a fun one. I'd say using the law of cosines here would be the quickest. Hmm. First, you need to set up an equation. Then, since A and C are prime numbers, you can rearrange it like this and... Done. Oh, C'est magnifique! A brilliant method! I thought these kinds of problems were easy for you. Were you just testing me? I didn't mean anything by it. True, I did have in mind a number of ways to solve this, but I found myself wondering about your thought process. I have to say, your speed and accuracy were impressive. Then I'll test you on the next one. Let's race and see who can solve it quicker. The two of them are taking their studies seriously. I should try to focus as well. Oh, it's been quite some time already. We should remember to take breaks. That is important. You've got a point. Focusing for too long has diminishing returns. Let's rest for a bit. Well then, why don't we resume in 20 minutes? You can spend your time however you'd like until then. Oh, come to think of it, I haven't gotten any running in today. Guess I'll head out for a refresher. Of course, gotta train. You're leaving the building? You do understand we only have 20 minutes, correct? Even a short workout's a nice change of pace. What were you guys planning on doing? I was thinking of making some tea. What about you? Hmm. I'm gonna doodle in my notebook. I'll read a book. Ooh, a fine choice. I often read books on my breaks myself. Let's yeah, see. So. Why don't I ready enough tea for all three of us? Akihiko, it wouldn't hurt to try reading for a change. Fine. Guess I'll join you guys this time. <laughs> ah, yes, the great lie. After the break, we got back to studying. The, the lie being that... Uh, you are only productive if you're physically doing something. Mm. Because sometimes the most productive thing you can do is rest. That's right. The subtle tension in the air helped me stay on track. Loose's academics. One day we'll be a genius! I appreciate you inviting us today. You wanted to help take our minds off of recent events, didn't you? 
Yeah, something like that. <laughs> Did you think we didn't notice? <laughs> you know, it's usually the senpai's role to do these kinds of things. But we decided to take you up on it. Thanks to this, Akihiko and I were able to get back on our feet. You can expect we'll return the favor in kind. Yeah, we'll help push you as far as your brain can go. Your exams <laughs> won't know what hit them. Exam training! Listen, I'm top of my class, now, you don't have to worry about call me. It a day. That's Make true. sure to get your rest, both of you. you gotta stay sharp though, right? Yeah, yeah sure. What you mm -hmm. could do, however, is help Junpei, because I'm sure he hasn't been doing anything related to close to studying. Good Old Stupei. Yep, he's probably still hanging out with Chidori. Have you noticed, Yuki? Normally, after a successful operation, the number of apathy syndrome cases decreases. However, this time, it's the opposite. I did notice that. Mm hmm. There's only one shadow left. It must be apprehensive. Only one left. Hmm. I thought we had three left. Yes. Oh, but we fought two, I guess, technically, in that last we one? We did. Yep, we fought two. Oh, man, that. Believe it or mm -hmm. not, viewers, we're still probably only a little past the halfway mark. Correct. So what's what's next here? Huh? Yeah, exactly. I, I'm sure people are like, what? People who play Persona games know this is nowhere close to the end. But <laughs> if that's indeed the case, then we'll put into the rest of the next battle. In any event, if it weren't for you, we wouldn't be here. So thank you. Yeah, I'm curious to see how things are going to That's shift all fundamentally. Did you write that down? You better <laughs> hurry up or I'm about to erase it. I'm still writing? Hurry up! What about you? What have you been doing this whole time? Texting or something? Of course. Exams start next Tuesday. There's no time to waste. Let's just move on to the next problem. I'm feeling sleepy. Stay awake! I Gotta stay awake. Now. Did you write that down? Our academics still I, aren't maxed out. I know. Okay, that was more than enough time. I'm going to erase it now. Really, I'm going to do it. Oh, and I heard that one of you has been counting how many times I say, Did you write that down? How about focusing on your notes? <laughs> Force myself to stay awake this to this. Watch out, shock's coming at your head. Feel a murderous intent? Yes. Ugh, dink. Uh, I kind of want to play five again now. We will be on to three. Five Royal is so good. Yeah. Uh, let's see. All right. Who we get messages from? Come quickly. It's good for your skin. Quality coffee. Urgently hiring. Yeah, so we need to go to... Yeah, back to the freaking first floor faculty office again. Oh, right. Still looking to get that helmet. We are progressing that quest still. Mr. Odo. Oh no. Odo. Oh no. Odo. Odo, Odo, Odo. Odo, Odo, Odo. Mr. Oh no seems to have stepped out. Good grief. Uh, did Miss Toriyumi go home already? The teacher's log is a mess. Is she such an expert on composition? What's with this syntax? Are these weird symbols to the side? Is this some kind of face? Will she ever grow up? What do you want? Yuki. Why didn't you speak up sooner? Didn't think that. Don't think that people will lead you around by the hand once you're out in the real world. So, what do you want? Miss Toriyumi seems to have left her share of unfinished work behind. Good. Having a teacher like her in charge of your class must be a severe impediment to your pursuit of education. You'll never guess what she said during the teacher's conference the other day. I feel as if what I think you were saying isn't wrong. What is with that? I can't make hands or tails of syntax that tortured. Because of teachers like her, I can hardly blame you youngsters for your grammar, can I? Understood. I had to look at that sentence twice to make sure I read it right. <laughs> now listen to me yeah. carefully to begin with proper grammar is... <laughs> Confusingly worded. I was lectured on proper sentence structure. I mean... The syntax is a little strange. Mm -hmm. I, <laughs> I understood what it was, but... Mr. Odo doesn't seem to be returning. I decided to give up for today. <laughs> Gotta talk to every teacher in the school before Mr. Odo comes back with the helmet. Yeah, of course. Whee! All right, more star today. Today is indeed star rank three. Yeah. 
More Kaiwan. <laughs> Kaiwan. Kaiwan. I got 30 laps around this area, but now I'm starving. Yeah. So just spend time with Moon soon again, Mr. Dust Eater. At some point. Yep. Or rather. All right. Yeah, King I'm of Gourmet. Fancy today and adding an egg the Gourmet to my order. indeed. Fancy egg. So fancy. Whew, that hit the spot. You get a lot of bang for your buck here. Man, I can't remember the last time I had such a fresh egg. Maybe I should get some for them, too. Okay, so we need to do who's them here. Who's they? Who's they? Oh, my siblings. I've got four younger ones. Oh. Our apartment's pretty small, though, so we're packed like sardines. Okay, so sounds like fun. There's never a dull moment. You want to come over sometime? Might be fun, as long as the floor doesn't collapse. But you know, back then, it was <laughs> oh, no. a lot more. I never mentioned this, but... Hmm. My father died five years ago. We were told his car fell off a cliff. Ooh. I'm not fishing for sympathy or anything. I, I just thought you should know. That's kind of brutal. I also told me about his family situation. He's going through some tough times. Well, yeah, well, one of my friends just died. I feel like we're getting closer. Yeah. Rival athlete. Oh, oh, yeah, sorry. This late? The preschool's gonna be letting out soon. See ya. Well, bye now. Oh, he's he's that level of responsible for his siblings. Yep. It's getting dark, so I should head home. Does it all. At least he cares. Not checked out. That's right. Yeah. Oh, welcome back. Oh, hey, welcome back. The next full moon will be our last operation, huh? Kind of surreal. Wait, I have to stop getting distracted. Exams are next week. Oh, it's so hard to focus. So, speaking of exams, another study session with Fuka this time. Oh, Yuki-kun, good timing. I was just about to invite Yukari-chan and Junpei-kun to study. I was wondering if you'd like to join, too. Let's study together! Thank you. Really? Thanks, I'll go ask the others. I'm glad everyone showed up for this. I probably wouldn't have been able to concentrate on my own. Hmm. Yeah, it hasn't been very long. Thanks for inviting me. I think this will be a big help for me, too. We've got to keep going. It's the only thing we can do. <laughs> You're right. Justin. Just gonna leave it so right. Yeah. yeah. Mata kun and Sonata Senpai have been trying to move on too. Um, I don't mean to be a busybody, but if there's anything you need help with, please let me know. I am the one who suggested the study session after all. That's not being a busybody. Fuka, you don't need to worry about a thing, okay? Sorry, it's just, I always admire things like this. You know, everyone meeting up to study together. I always thought it would be nice to stop by a restaurant on our way home and help each other out. <laughs> I can make that wish come true. Let's see, what should you help me with first? It's supposed to go <laughs> both ways. <laughs> yeah, that's what I would say. <laughs> If it's health and gym class, I've got your back. Bro. You can do that on your own time. I'm glad I came to the storm. Even after a terrible tragedy, you guys helped me remember how to smile. I'm glad you came here too, Fuka. Oh, right. Could you help me with this part? Sure. Hmm. This one's difficult. Let's see. I appreciate that while they are trying to move on and maintain some level of normalcy, which is sometimes the best thing you can do when you're dealing with grief, right? Mm -hmm. Is um, that it's not being pushed, narratively speaking, right? Like the uh, um, 
sometimes with pacing in stories in video games or otherwise you have these big dramatic events and then it's almost like it never happened aside from like a couple of throwaway lines or something like that but I appreciate and this is something I think every Persona game has done that if there is a major event that it has impacted the party they sit with it even while still trying to pursue that normalcy yeah yeah like it's a common thing in persona games and what you were talking about earlier where um the whole narrative focus kind of shifts at a certain point also it's a very very common thing when dealing with grief or just a heavy situation you know that does happen so right i appreciate that as well yeah the humanity of it all all right you're up jupe all right what do we got here Health? Jim? Wait, Matt? Yeah, I'll pass. <laughs> By helping each other out, I think we were able, to, or I was able to study more effectively. <laughs> Math, I'll pass. <laughs> All right. Mathing. Math time. <sighs> I was in the zone. I guess that really did help me take my mind off of things. Mm-hmm. It's nice to know that we're not alone. The power of friendship. Yes, the power of friendship. Dude, you did not just say that. How corny can you be? <laughs> I love you it, though. You get what you mean, though. <laughs> I fight for <laughs> my we'll friends. just keep giving it our all. It's <laughs> the least we can do to take some weight off our senpais. Okay, I think it's about time we call it a night. Thanks for the help, guys. Good night. Me and all right, all right. Okay. Oh, yes. Mr. Edogawa. He's my favorite. <laughs> I think he's mine too, but mostly because he has no eyes. Yeah. He's, um, <laughs> he goes on for like an hour and a half about a topic like I do. <laughs> so, uh, that's why I like him. Yeah, he's his, a kindred spirit. <laughs> his topic is always magic, though. Yes. All right. I, I can also go on about magic systems. Anyway, that's, go ahead. That's fair. Okay. <laughs> that's fair. <laughs> okay, time to get started. Exams are coming up. Ready for today's lesson? Aha, Adonai, Tetragamaton. Tetragamaton. Um, we've covered the time of magical growth and just about reached the modern age. And just as every art of science branches off its, its two sub-studies as it progresses, magic began subdividing and around the 18th century. Some people preached of morals, some focused on communicating with spirits, etc. There was even the man who founded modern psychology based on his research into hypnosis. This too is magic, the ability to see into the human mind. As a result of magical research flourishing, which hunts grew more common. To avoid this, the practice went underground to secret societies. I'm sure many of you have heard the names of at least some of these organizations. Hmm. The Rosicrucian Order, the Freemasons, the Illuminati, the Golden Dawn. Interestingly enough, many of these societies are still with us today. As for the forefathers of modern, mod modern magic, they are simply too numerous to count. For instance, there's Elephas Levi, a man who attempted to combine modern and ancient systems of magic. His literature, which took a scientific approach, is still being published to this day. Madame Blavatsky was the renowned magician on the 19th century and the figurehead of the theosophy in her lifetime. Many magical societies stemmed from the Theosophical Society, which Blavatsky founded with a few close associates. Franz Mesmer opened the path to psychology in his studies on life energy. And Rudolf Steiner, once a member of the Theosophical Society, founded Anthroposophy. Can you stop throwing $20 words at me? Anthroposophy. Yes, thank you. Mm -hmm. But she called it spiritual science. It, you know, like if I was reading this in my mind and I haven't read it out loud, I'm sure I would have very little issues. <laughs> <laughs> but no, it's, you know, late at night, so I gotta stumble over everything. Of course. There was Elister Crowley, of course, the 20th century most well known magician, and George Gurdjieff. A mystic who. Yeah, I don't know, man. <laughs> Mm -hmm. A mystic who taught his minister the fourth way, also known as the work or the system. 
Each one of them was a living archive of esoteric knowledge. Are you still hearing me? Not frozen with fear, I trust. <laughs> <laughs> Allow me to test if you're paying attention. It is wrong and your sign will change. Aha, I deny. Tetragrammaton. Okay, then. Now, who to pick? Yuki answers thou wilt. Who was the founder of Theosophy? A group that gave rise to many other magical societies. Ah, uh, that would be Blavatsky, right? Correct. Yeah. Good. Good, good. Remember to still get blessed go on lucky years, though. At any rate, the magical arts progressed even further with their practical use. Thanks to the archiving and proliferation of these arts by the people we've covered today. Oof. All right. He always has the most interesting things to talk about, that's for sure. Yeah, do you um do you remember what the Tetragrammaton is? No. Okay, <laughs> so the Tetragrammaton is the word I believe in the Jewish scriptures for God, Y H W H, uh, is is what it looks like Romanized. Y H W H. Oh, yeah, yeah, Yahweh. yeah, Yahweh, Jehovah, depending on um, how it's yeah, specifically. Je Jehovah, so it, it called that, but yeah, the four-letter Hebrew name for God. Right, yeah, uh, I got you. That's the Tetragrammaton. Okay. Also, if you've seen the movie Equilibrium, the uh, clerics in that are called Grammaton clerics. They're clerics of the Tetragrammaton. Oh, he's got a mask on his face today. You're not feeling well, bud? He does. You being creepy, mm. got you sick, is that what happened? Got the flu or something. Yeah. Anyway. Okay. So we have stayed <laughs> up through the lesson. We are going back to the faculty office. <laughs> <laughs> Bukichi, are you? you? That's fantastic. When I send you a <laughs> message like this, it reminds me of the time I used to write love letters to Mitsuka-chan. Come visit us when you have time. We're always welcome to open arms. So this is a sweet old man. Yeah. We are going to see him, but we got to go to the faculty office. Right. For first. Hi! Not soon. Emergency! Hi. Oh, my God. Don't worry. Go he always has some kind of emergency going on. I know, on. right? I'm the most beautiful man in the world! All right, let's see. Come on. Please... Uh, nope. <laughs> nope. <sighs> Hi, Maya. Uh, what up? Damn it, I did it again. And does the class 2F have their next lecture? Listen. Oh, Yuki, what's up? Oh, I know. You brought me some cake, huh? I'm not a fan of Mont Blanc, but I like all the other kinds. That reminds me. Uh, I didn't mean to say that, but hey, you're here just in time. I forgot to explain something in my last lecture, so I was just going to go tell the class real quick. If I don't do it, I'm going to get reprimanded. It's tough being a teacher. If I explain it to you right now, could you pass it on to everyone else? It doesn't have to be detailed explanation or anything. Oh, do you want some watermelon the next time I have some leftover? Ah, she is like 18 different directions <laughs> right now. I know, she's everywhere. I can practically feel that old stickler at Coda glaring at me. Damn, guess I'll have to do it myself. Well, I might as well practice giving the lecture with you anyway. I mean, we've already established you're not going to give the lecture in my place, right? I listened to Miss Toriyumi's lecture alone. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Mr. Ono doesn't seem to be returning. I'll be back tomorrow. Wait, where have We're you been? Like, I just want it. a helmet, man. He's in the Sengoku era. He built a time machine. You know, weirder things have happened. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So we are going to Hieroglyph rank eight. Bukichi. Let's go. You're finally here. We've been waiting for you. I wanted to tell you the good news as soon as possible. It's about a customer who came by earlier. Who do you think it was? Here's a hint. Signature. Mm -hmm. A fan of yours? A fan of yours? Indeed, that's what we say, a fan of yours. That's right. How'd you guess? One of my fans came by. He said he'd bring the rest of the fan club next time. 
Yeah, I wish. Actually, it was one of the organizers of a campaign to save the persimmon tree. He said, let's protect the tree together. He's already gathered a number of signatures from students who are in our son's class. Nice. Anything here? That's amazing. There you go. Everyone's banding together to honor the memory of our son. He really was loved by many. Okay. Of course. He was our proud son. I'm sure he's just as happy as we are. All right. Let's go to GeckoCon right now. I have to tell my son the good news. Okay. I'm just trying to remember the story here. Their son was mm -hmm. a teacher at GeckoCon, right? And he got like hit by so. a vehicle. Yes. Okay. I believe that's correct. And we say right now here. Don't flake on me now. You're the one who made this happen, right? You must take part in the ceremony. But, but... I've but, never been so excited to go for a walk before. The elderly couple is showing their affection for me. Okay. <laughs> They're so funny. Oh man, rank eight. Let's race to the persimmon tree. I won't lose. Not even to a youngster like you. Come All on, right, let's do dear. it. We'll be back. Mm. Thanks for watching the store. <laughs> she just kind of stands there. <laughs> I visited the tree of Bunkichi san and then returned to the dorm. Oh, man. You know, as long as they've been married. I see you're back. He probably yeah. is like, whatever. <laughs> like, he is, he's up to his shenanigans again. Whatever. Right. Oh, you're back. <laughs> Monday's a holiday, so we have the next few days off. There's just one shadow left. I'm starting to get fired up. Come this far, so we can't lose now. Let's train as much as we possibly can. Let's make him proud. Oh, that reminds me, uh, in case you guys missed the last episode, or just forgot, uh, Akihiko did get a new persona. It is yes. Caesar. We can go look at it, right? We can. This kid got one as well. Alright, persona. He got a new theurgy as well. Um, Alright, so mm -hmm. Caesar, a statesman general and author known for his rule over the Roman Republic, his full name was Gaius Julius Caesar. His many accomplishments led to his name being used as a title for later Roman emperors. Et tu, Brute? Oh, I didn't even notice the guy sitting on the throne inside the chest. That's actually kind of clever. Yeah. Crazy looking. Yep. Yeah. Wait, who is that sitting there? I assume it's Caesar sitting with him. Yeah, I guess Caesar. so. Yeah. Yeah, well, he's got, like, it's his golem or something. Yeah, exactly. Um, and we also, like I said, got a second theurgy, which is electric onslaught, so I'm looking forward to using that at some point. High chance of shock. Yeah, that one, I'm looking forward to seeing that one. And then Ken, as well, got a second theurgy in Persona. The second theurgy is Divine Intervention, which is... Sounds really strong, at least. Revised Party fully restores allies' HP and will reflect one attack. Yeah, that it says one attack, not one fizz or magic. So I think it's kind of like uh, Haru's Shield of Justice from Persona 5 Royal, where it's both. Yeah. Probably doesn't reflect Almighty, though. Yeah, very little things do, if anything. Yeah. All right, and this one is uh, Kala Nemi, which is his new persona. Crazy looking. A Hindu goddess whose name means Edge of the Wheel of Time. The wheel refers to samsara the cycle of death and rebirth meaning she is a goddess who has transcended life itself that's really interesting implications given what's been going on yeah samsara is uh, a big concept in some some megaton games so very very interesting guess what we're doing today i'm gonna go out a limb and say we're walking Kormar. correct <laughs> correct amundo Kormar is looking at me with pleading eyes Seems he wants to go for a walk. Amada can come with us tonight. Ooh, that's gonna be interesting. Let's see if we actually talk about anything serious. <sighs> I finally caught up. You're too fast, Koromaru. Don't go running at top speed like that. My legs aren't long enough. Um, Senpai, 
Is it all right if I rest a bit? <laughs> sure. Um, I, I wanted to apologize for causing so much trouble, uh, making everyone worry about me. I lost something very precious, but in exchange, I gained something just as important. That's why I think I'll be all right on my own now. Thank you for bringing me along today. <laughs> oh, there you are. Guess it's about time. Huh? Looks like koromaru has got something. It's a bone. No, it's an item. It's an incense. <laughs> I wonder what this is. I'm curious where it came from, but it's getting late. We should head back. Kinda... All right. This time, I'm not going to lose. Let's go, Koromaru. I'm not going to lose. I just have to wonder that maybe, like, the old uh, monk that he, he, Koromaru used to stay with just had a stash of incense that he's been going <laughs> up to and grabbing periodically. Yeah. Exams are coming up. It's almost time for the home shopping show. Mm. Unrelated sentences. <laughs> oh, I've got a shelf. All right. We do indeed have a shelf. Uh, okay. So yeah, this is a Sunday, so we can go ahead and grab. Um, there is nothing about the home shopping network. Feel free to check it if you want, but eh. apparently it's not selling anything that matters. So I don't care about yeah, Tanaka. Tanaka. Time to go buy our bubbly. I'm just sitting there eating noodles. I know. Mm, sounds awesome. Vending machine. Fountain Oh, whoops. Station. Wah, 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 wah. Mad Bull. The four biotic pack. And happiness water. Definitely <laughs> lemonade. I can't believe it's not lemonade. Alright. It's simply, no, not simply. Legally distinct. <laughs> lemonade. Yeah, legally distinct <laughs> lemonade. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we need to go to the shrine, and we're doing Sun Rank Two. Okay. Uh, and okay, and that's hold on, hold on, don't don't do anything yet. Um, hold on. Uh, okay, so the Sun Social Link does not need a matching persona. Oh, all right. So you can just go ahead. <laughs> oh, this is the. Fox? No, no, it's uh, the, yeah, the dying young man here. Correct. Akinari. You. You. Oh, it's nothing. Why don't you have a seat? This bench is too big for me alone. Sure. Yeah. Then this bench shall be our meeting place. You're not like the others. Why am? And it doesn't. Oh, yeah. gotcha. Why am I different? I didn't expect to see you again. Usually, people don't come back. Nobody treats me like a normal person. Not even my friends or family. They all keep their distance and say, Oh, what a poor soul. All they feel is pity and curiosity towards me. Mm. Sorry to disappoint them, but I'm not the poor soul they think I am. Dying isn't so bad, is it? What's the point of dragging out your time in this world, anyhow? Hmm. Never thought about that. They say that necessity is the mother of our industrialized society. And yet, fire does not realize that it's burning away. Not exactly foolishness, but sad nonetheless. Thank you for coming today. You seem different from the rest. Hmm. I'm not sure I know how to describe it exactly, but you don't look on me with pity the way everyone else does. Kamaki seems intrigued by me. I feel like our relationship is stronger. Rank two. Mm -hmm. yeah, this, is, this is a heavy social <laughs> link. 
Yeah. Damn it. What did I do to deserve this body? <laughs> I hope we can meet again. I parted ways with Kamaki, and then headed back to the door. Yeah, I'm not... I'm not sure what to expect for the ending of his social link. Welcome back. Yeah. Greetings. Hmm. The day after tomorrow, periodic examinations begin. How are your preparations progressing? Until recently, I have been reserving my energy for the final battle. However, according to Mitsuru-san, studying for exams is a crucial component in preparing for the future. Therefore, yes. while I may be off to a late start, I will now initiate study mode. <laughs> I guess we're studying yes. with her tonight. We are indeed. Oh, look at what Fuka's wearing. Hold on. That's adorable. Oh, yeah, the winter clothes. The shawl. I like the shawl. Yeah. Anyway. Very yeah. festive. <laughs> yes. All right, I guess. I have heard that high school students engage in a social event called a study group before exams. Such an activity may allow us to learn more about one another. Is this permissible? Sure. I mean, Let's you already stared it. daggers into my soul whenever we get out of class, so... <laughs> Imagine that. Allow me to retrieve my textbooks and other study materials. I have detected a gaze upon us for an estimated seven minutes now. What? It's an awful long time for them to just be staring. <laughs> They're just oh, hanging out. Oh, sorry. I just wanted to watch. Was I bothering you? Watching us study? I can stare too. <laughs> Don't worry about it. <laughs> Thanks. I was just curious what it's like to study for an exam. Um, is it alright if I study with you? If it isn't too much trouble, I mean. My I'm data bad. states that elementary school does not feature regular examinations. Is this information inaccurate? No, you're right. We don't really have tests that we need to study a whole week in advance for. Sorry, um, if you're not okay with it, I can just... Go get your books, bro. Oh, thank you. I'll go get my workbooks now. Next question. What is the term used to describe the property of having zero electrical resistance? I know! Superconductivity! Correct, Amada-san. Nice. Go! Superconductive Super cyclone! <laughs> <laughs> very good, very good. Yeah! That's it! The Featherman Technique! It's so cool! I mean, that's what I heard from a friend, anyway. <laughs> oh, sorry, Koromaru. I guess I was being a little loud. Let's get back to studying. Don't worry, Ken. I'll go watch Featherman movies with you. We all started taking our studies seriously. I feel like I'm focusing better than usual. All that focus. Man. This academic... Someday. <laughs> it's... Look, I know we haven't been hitting it as hard as the other two. It appears that Amada-san has entered a state of non-REM sleep. He is in a deep slumber. But, like, it kind of feels like academics final tier just requires a million extra points. Yeah, I think it's just harder to get adequate points to level it up yeah. quickly than like the other two. That's probably so. true. But... Sleeping here may cause his body temperature to decline sharply, risking illness. Shall we wake him? Smack it. Let's carry him to his room. Understood. I wonder what kind of dreams Amada-san will have. Let's transport him carefully to prevent waking. I will accompany you on the way to his room. Hmm. That's kind of adorable. Indeed. Today is health and sports day. There's no school. I'm to think about oh, the boy. crops I plant on the rooftop should be ready to harvest. Oh boy. Well, let's go do that too. Tomates. The harvest has increased. Maybe it's because I studied how to grow them well. Ooh, five healthy <laughs> tomatoes. All right, let's plant something. Should we do 
Ooh, we got soul spinach. We haven't done that yet, right? Right. Heals the soul. I'm assuming that's stamina points. I'm hoping it is. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's the Any SBIs we can get, I will gladly have. 1024 and onwards. All right. Very good. Okay, so now for the 12th here, we are going to do moon rank 7. Alright, I have a moon. I do not. Fine. Alonium Mall. Oops. Should have selected Velvet Room. Oh well. <laughs> nope, I don't need to talk to Elizabeth. I need to go into the door. Yay, Twilight Fragments! I'm forward to it. Yeah! How may I assist you? Alright. Suman. This is your progress so far. Dionysus? Mm. Please Ricardo? take a look. Yeah. Any moon persona. Yeah. Why not? Is this acceptable? Very well, it's yours. Are you finished? Right. For now. We look. I don't have to ask it with such a tone. <laughs> right. Hello? Yugi. Oh, hey, Makoto Kun. Want to grab a bite somewhere? I can hear my stomach crying out with a vengeance. Feels as if we can grow closer using Dionysus. Should I spend time with swimming soon? Yeah, let's do it. Yes! All Wonderful, right. my gourmet friend! <laughs> to be honest, I needed to talk to you today. So we need a spot where we can eat good meat and chat, and I know just the place. What I'm about to tell you is top secret. This is for your ears only, okay? This world is gonna end soon. All of humanity is gonna be completely wiped out. But don't worry, talking to Pharaohs? we'll be recreating it as a new <laughs> land for the survivors. Paradise. Is that true? Well, did that just blow your mind? <laughs> uh, op option C, the world is ending. The question, yeah, with the question mark, the world is ending? The world is ending? Yeah, I'm freaking out, man. It, hey, not so loud. I told you <laughs> it's top secret. We don't want to start a mass panic. The world is ending? In paradise, everyone has wings and perfect figures. And they smell like flowers. I... I can finally be reborn into a worthwhile body! But if we don't do something, you'll get left behind when the world ends. And I do not want that to happen. So come on! We'll go to paradise together! Don't do it to? because you're my subject, okay? Do it because we're... friends! I get the feeling Sumitsu considers me a good friend. I feel like our relationship is stronger. <laughs> like, who you been talking to, dog? Okay, yeah, so how know, about right? this? If we factor in initiation fees, scriptures, and other products, uh, it comes out to 132,000 yen. You could take out a loan, right? Not to mention, you'll get a discount since I'll be referring you to. <laughs> you are one lucky guy. <laughs> does it matter which one? This does not matter now. Okay. We can pick either one. <laughs> There's no way I'm paying that. You what? Do you have any idea what you're saying? I just wanted to share eternal happiness with you because I care about your soul. I guess you're serving the house of splendor. I have to go repent on your behalf. Exactly. In the name of faith. Emergency. I decided to go back to the door. For those who have watched us for any length of time, especially in Xenogears. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Then you know that I come from a religious, well, Dan and I both come from religious backgrounds, but mm -hmm. uh, I still proclaim the faith. Mm -hmm. um, 
if it requires you to spend money for the <laughs> salvation it promises, it's not worth your time. <laughs> yeah. You would grieve. Hmm. Uh, we can't simply ignore what happened. It's difficult to focus on studying at such a time. However, it would be unwise to ignore what's right in front of you as well, cold as it may sound. I'll try to think of something to help everyone focus on the exams. Yeah, like, I don't want to go too deep into that because it's a conversation that could go on for hours, but... Anyway, yes. yeah, just... Uh, it is indeed. <laughs> <laughs> that's a mess that he's gotten himself into. Mm, it sure is. You, yeah. You go driving on your bike tonight, Mitsuru? That's right. All right. Uh, yeah, we, we are going to be doing the study group this evening. Figures. Because then we got exams yep. all next hmm. week. Correct. It seems some of us are having trouble focusing on studying for the exams, Junpei. So I was thinking of holding a study group for all of us. What do you think of that? Good idea. Precisely. So you agree. Then it's settled. I'll ask everyone to gather immediately. When you're ready, wait for me at the table over there. I'll see you in a bit. Right then. I decided to hold this study session for us to concentrate on the upcoming exams. Amada, I invited you to join us so you can focus on your own studies. Your presence is welcome here. Thank you for inviting me. I'll make sure not to be a bother to everyone. To the rest of you, I want you to set a proper example and take your studies seriously. <laughs> Are you going to study with us, Korochan? Good boy. Koromaru-san says that he will accompany us here as we study. Well, aren't you a little hard worker? Unlike Junpei over there who can't stop yawning. <laughs> I can't really deny it. Wouldn't mind being in his place right about now. Dogs never have to study for exams like this. Man, what a life. <laughs> Thank you, Pei. <laughs> Stay. <laughs> um, go home. Time for me to go back to my room. <laughs> Wait, don't try to get rid of me. <laughs> oh my God. Koromaru-san may not person. have an obligation to study, but he has another important mission. True. He's been protecting that shrine this whole time. That sounds like something far more difficult. Guess if you want to be a dog, you'd better develop some diligence, like Koromaru here. Being a dog is harder than it seems. You'd be better off just studying, Junpei-san. Oh, stop! Don't look at me like some pitiful creature! <laughs> All right, that's enough chit-chat. Let's concentrate on our studies. Uh-huh. <laughs> Knowing everyone's watching keeps me accountable. Good staring. Ooh, we got three points that time. Yep. All right, I think we can begin wrapping things up. Good work, everyone. And Yuri, <laughs> of course it's not after all the dog talk, I do hope you were able to get through the material you needed to cover. Uh, what? <laughs> oh, I see. So you're still learning then? As a dog, I'll need to give you strict behavioral training. Oh my. Yeah, I, I'm kidding. It was a joke. I'm totally cool being human. No training needed. I'm good. That will conclude the group study <laughs> session. It is time for a much deserved rest. Akihiko's going to go for a run. Of course. Now it's exams time. Mm hmm. Time to fast forward like four days, five days. Yeah. All right. Here we go. Mm hmm. Question seems familiar. The hormone dopamine is related to our sense of accomplishment. Name a symptom of its overproductive. Overproduction. Addiction. Oh. I have a feeling this is the right answer. Me and my big pen. B I C. Ha. 
This question seems familiar. Who is considered by many to be the first numerologist whose name lives on today in mathematical theorem? Pythagoras, right? Correct. See, I'm paying attention. I have a feeling this is the right answer. You started talking a little bit like that teacher as well. Oh, did I? Reading it. It was funny. Yeah. <laughs> well. I, what, I noticed. <laughs> what can I say? <laughs> <laughs> uh, what happens when electrical resistance re reaches zero? Hint, it was the word I used to confess my love to someone. <laughs> what? <laughs> Yes, superconductivity. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't even know what that means. I'm, maybe the teacher mentioned something about confessing their feelings for somebody like that, but I don't remember that. <laughs> this question seems familiar. What is the meaning of the phrase to spill the beans? To reveal a to secret. Reveal a secret. I would yes. like to clarify my point by spilling these beans. Why are there beans everywhere? Seventeen. Just chugging through this month. It's the last day of exams. The questions are just too easy. My pen won't stop moving. Clickety clacks. So easy. Barely an inconvenience. Ooh. Where, the, where is I guess? I know, it's shocking. Where is she? <laughs> Did her brain okay. fry? Did she short circuit? She's busy. She had to go do things. I don't know. Probably. Um, go to the first floor faculty office. Oh yeah, I completely forgot that, that was something we were doing. Uh huh. All right. Nope. And Not again. Year. I should get going. There's no time to waste. If I power walk to the station, it'll take seven minutes. But if I consider the speed at which the train pulls into the station, three minutes might not be enough. Oh yeah, I'm in charge of dinner tonight, so that's another 12 minutes to get groceries. I better compensate for the pressure ratio and mashed potatoes to avoid inefficiency. If an average potato's diameter is about 12 centimeters, that comes out to... Oh, forget it. Going home isn't worth the trouble. I'm staying at school. <laughs> Oh, it's you. Did you want to stay the night at school, too? You're looking for Mr. Ono? Now that you mention it, I haven't seen that hel helmet lately. Oh, um, I mean that teacher. <laughs> I don't have time to fritter away looking for him either, so try again later. By the way... You know, that helmet of his really is a nice piece. I'd never say that to Mr. Ono's face because I'd never hear the end of it, but it's fine craftsmanship. The curved line on the top, it's an ideal arc for absorbing impact. An arc like that can absorb about 48% of the impact from above. Then there's the material. It's not just a thick chunk of metal. It's extremely thin metal, in fact, layered with finely braided hemp for added practicality. Mr. Takanozuka keeps going on and on with his lecture. And that's how it's done. So that explains that. See, isn't it wonderful specimen? Hmm? Its origin? Uh -huh. I wouldn't know anything about that. I was zero interest in archaeology. I learned how ancient helms are constructed. Yeah, I mean, honestly, when you look into how armor was constructed at the time, mm -hmm. it really is smart the way it was constructed. Mm. Yeah. Um, yeah, like the Sengoku era of helm. Yeah, like, not, well, not just Japanese armor, right, which has its own mm -hmm. uniqueness to it, but, like, even if you look at a European, like what we think of like plate mail and chain mail and all of that, like they all had, they were all made as a response to a specific type of weaponry. Right. So, like while we think, oh, well that wouldn't work nowadays because a bullet would just go through it or whatever, it's like, well they weren't dealing with bullets, they were dealing with swords and arrows. And the reason right. the chest piece is angled the way that it is is so the arrows deflect off to the side, you know, like... Mm -hmm. It's interesting. It is. It's very interesting. Anyway. So we're going to do strength rank eight. Sweet. Uh, I don't have a strength. All right. That's fine. You got to go get one. I, I'm not strong enough, Dan. I got to go get some more. 
You should go acquire a strength. I sh one singular unit of strength. Yep. All right. Precisely. Welcome to the Velvet Room. Oops. I know I don't want to talk. How may I assist you? <laughs> I want to fuse. Suman. Please take a look. All right. Strength, 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 strength. Okay. Really? Who will you get? Hanuman is the last one we thank we This fused? persona, yes? Hanuman. We didn't fuse him. Oh, we collected him. Mm -hmm. Matador was the last one we fused. Yeah. Alright, uh, well, I'll just stick with Valkyrie. Is this acceptable? May it be your inner strength. She's cool. Very well. We look... But we should get some more strength persona. Agreed. I want to get a strength persona that is literally just this humongous creature. <laughs> what? I don't know. Like, uh, like the Hecaton Kyries is not a strength persona, but like, oh, like a weird, screwed up looking thing it or something. Screwed up. It just has to be one that's literally just a massive. Oh, all right. An absolute right. unit of strength. Just commenting on the. Okay, yes. I understand. Uh, so or classroom hallway. Yeah, there's there was no purpose behind that aside from just oh that'd be kind of fun. All right. So purposeless. Yeah, there's some there's some interesting strength persona. Let's celebrate. Hey, yeah. Yuko, I'm sorry you did not win. I'm pretty much ready to throw that party, so I thought today might be a good time. Which they might not show up here, but. All right. No backing out now. Um. How about my place? Don't worry, I tidied up beforehand. Oh my. Um, sorry that the party ended up being at my place. I was out buying stuff that might be useful for running practice, and I ran out of money. <laughs> well, I think her uh, stereo is cool looking. Oh yeah, that is cool. It's got the little equalizer there. Yeah. Any option here. Oh, really? Good thing I took the time to tidy up. <laughs> Feel free to eat as many snacks as you want, okay? You? It was a lot of hard work, but I'm glad we decided to coach those kids in the end. What do you think? <sighs> um, sorry. It's just, I never noticed how long your eyelashes are. Oh my. <laughs> I don't think I've looked at you this closely before. It's only nice. the two of us here now. Maybe that's why I'm a little nervous. Chill. Uh, how about we change the subject? I'll ask you a question. Mm. Oh, do you like children? <laughs> I do. <laughs> really? Me too. I like how they're so pure and always try their best. It just makes me want to support them as much as I can. I realized recently how much I like to look after other people. Mm. Let's see. Uh, okay, next question. Let's say you get married and have a kid. Would you want it to be a boy or a girl? Oh. A girl. <laughs> Me too. Oh, we must be on the same wavelength. I would dress her up in all kinds of different outfits. Oh, she could be my little helper. Either way, I would just hope that the baby didn't take after me. You could say I'm a little rough around the edges. But if they took after you, I'm sure they'd be super cute. They'd probably be athletic, too. Wonder if they'll take an interest in sports. Yuko seems to be deep in thought. I feel like our relationship has grown. Oof. By the way, do you look more like your dad or your mom? I've been told that I'm the spitting image of my dad. It's not that I mind, but I do have mixed feelings about it. Hmm. I mean, we don't look that much alike, right? My eyebrows aren't as bushy for one. <laughs> Interesting. Well, your dad must be a cutie. <laughs> Chatted with Yuko for a while, then returned to the dorm. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. Welcome back. Sup, dude? Whew, five days from hell are finally over. Yo, you want to head to old Tartar tonight? Tartar? I'll think about it. I'll Tartar? <laughs> really, Junpei? 
Oh. <laughs> All right. God. I got to get the sips off the brain, you know? <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. What's wrong with old Tartar? After that, Junpei needs to get some redemption. Oh. <laughs> redemption. <laughs> it just. Oh, good. Very no. Good. Oh, man. That hit me just right. All right. Or just wrong, I guess. <laughs> um. It's so wrong, but it feels so right. Anyway. We we, <laughs> we are walking doggo. Of course. Doggo doggo. Is there ever a point where he can be walked that we won't walk him? I have no idea. <laughs> That's a good question. Oh, hey. Fancy seeing you here again. Uh, what up? You're surprisingly diligent taking care of that little guy. He's taking care of me, all right? Let's be honest. I mean, I keep there telling them that we're just childhood friends, but they won't stop prying about it. <laughs> what? Oh, looks like he's back. Guess I'll start heading home then. See you later. We should finish his social link soon, too. Dormar and I return yeah, to the dorm. Ooh, time for vending machines. Yes, indeed. New moon tonight, too. I've got a few messages. Mm -hmm. A little refresher. Hey, oh boy. Hey, you free? 18th. Um, TV shopping. Perfect. Now back to Sunday so quickly. Yep. Ah, uh, Maya. I miss thee. All right, anyway. I miss thee. <laughs> that irritatingly catchy song comes from the speakers. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the home shopping show of Tanaka's Amazing Commodities. All right. Don't touch that dial. I'm going to do it. An assortment of instant food. Too busy to whip up a full meal? Or maybe you've got a hankering for something quick and easy. Good, good. Then how about some instant curry and five of them to two? To boot, I must have pantry item. Oh my goodness, it's wonderful, but wait, Not there's more. Bad, we'll throw in this instant ramen too. Guess how many? Ten. All of this for just 49.80 yen. This is a limited special today. Today all night. Oh boy. <sighs> 5,000 yen for 15 Thanks, ramens. Kid. Next time we introduce a Halloween fun set, don't miss out. Oh yeah, thanks. That's it for today. We're all sold out. Sorry, folks. Bye -bye. We'll see you next Sunday. Same time, same channel. Okay. Drinks, 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 drinks. Go get the beverages. Uh, what are we going to do after that? We got. After that, we are doing Sun Rank 3. All right. And the station. So what do you think is going to happen with Chidori? Because she's still in the hospital as far as I know. Yeah. I don't know if I can answer that question. Um... I suspect he's gonna Yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> gotcha. Uh, I'm sorry, I wish I had more of an answer for that one, no, but I a, I can't. It's, okay. <laughs> it's all good. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, it's it's curious though, viewers, what do you think is gonna happen to her at this point? Yep. Wow, that's a lot of coughing, good grief. <laughs> He's having some troubles. Seriously, sorry. If you don't mind, please stay until I've caught my breath. All right. Thank you. <laughs> it's starting to settle down. Yeah, we're an asthmatic attack. Thank you for coming. It's comforting to have someone with me. Why do I have to face this alone? Why am I the one? 
I can't run around like I did as a child anymore, because my legs and heart won't even let me. All that's left is to draw my sheets around me and count the beats of my heart until they stop forever. That's morbid. Why is this Damn. only happening to me? Couldn't say. <laughs> of course not. No one could. I don't even know. I mean, I understand the reason I'm dying, but what even is the meaning of it? There isn't any meaning to life that I can find, so perhaps I'm not missing all that much. I wish I could run away, but if my body were capable of that, I wouldn't be here anyway. No matter what I do, my body is there to remind me I'm going to die. Why? Why me? <coughs> Please don't leave just yet. It's almost too much for me if I'm alone. Don't worry, you're not. Right. I suppose I shouldn't. I can accept it. I'm feeling a little better now. Thank you. My presence is comforting to Kamaki. <laughs> I feel like our relationship is stronger. It's starting to get dark. Don't worry, I'll be fine now. I hope I can see you again soon. I parted ways with Kamaki, then headed back to the dorm. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. All right. Now we are watching a recording. Ooh. <laughs> Command room. Command. That should be good. Meetings. What you make of it? Let's see. Ten, twelve, two thousand nine, fourteen fifty six. Starting playback. Oh my! What's happening here? Looks like Yukari's room. Like this, I guess. Welcome. I'll be taking care of you today. Are you ready to order, or do you need a little more time? Oh, right, the festival. Mm. Right. It's too bad the school festival got canceled. I already went to all the trouble of putting this on, so maybe I should wear it around the dorm for the day. I mm. would not recommend that if Jupe's going to be around you. Sup, Yucatan? Hey, does that mean you got to call me master? What's going on, go. Takuba? You planning to work at Mitsuru's mansion or something? <sighs> Forget it. I've been meaning to return this, but now that I look at it, it's a real uniform. Huh. It's not just a costume. Oh, I should take a picture before I give this back to Senpai. Yukari-chan, are you there? I need your help with something. Sure, one sec. I know. I'll drag Fuka down with me. At least then I won't be alone in the embarrassment. <laughs> Perfect. Yukari-chan, those clothes. I've got a couple spares if you want to try one on. How about it? Uh. Huh? Um, wait. Don't worry. Just hold still. It's a little tricky to put on, so it'll be faster if I help. Oh, wait! Yukari-chan! <laughs> the recording ends there. <laughs> uh. Oh, boy. Okay. And now, of course, we walk walk the dog. Koromaru's um 
Let's take him for a walk. Oh, hey, girl. Oh, hey, what's up? Oh my gosh, that is such a cute dog. I know, right? You are so lucky. <laughs> I'm not allowed to have pets at my place. Oh, wait, did you hear? Cause did it again. Of course he did. Seriously, how many times does it have to happen? This is exactly why his towels stink so bad. Oh no. <laughs> what? Oh, whoops. <laughs> Sorry, I got in the way of your walk, didn't I? I should start heading home anyway. Oh, see you later, doggy. That's Cormaro to you. <laughs> the 19th. Hey, the exam results are up. Perfect. I scored the highest in my grade. Everyone's looking at me with respect. And maybe a little bit of jealousy. <laughs> Charisma. Mitsuru promised to give me a gift if I scored well. I should talk to Mitsuru when I see her. Let's go back to class. And it becomes this. Yeah, this guy. Mouse man. Yeah, with the teeth. Yeah, yeah. This, this is why I thought of cheese. <laughs> I feel like it's an understandable response. <laughs> yeah, indeed. And then round up like this, and the answer is x equals what? Hmm? It isn't? Oh, I see. It becomes 11, so x equals 2. Hang on, what? Okay, uh, your assignment is to figure this one out. Anyway, wasn't that fun? Numbers are so interesting. Even with a difficult problem like this one, once it's solved, they become such a simple concept. Our entire reality is made up of numbers. Civilization owes its very existence to math. All right, Yuki-kun, you seem like a math fan. Here's a question for you. I'm not, by the way. We use the number <laughs> zero a lot. Do you know where it originally come from, though? Uh, Egypt, right? Mm, no. Oh. It's India. Okay, I knew it wasn't Rome, and I know Egyptians <laughs> contributed mathematics. So That's right. I wasn't sure exactly where. That's right. You really must be a mad fan. Isn't it fascinating how someone just up and conceived this concept of emptiness one day? Thus, with the birth of zero, all of mathematics took an enormous step forward. Ah, uh, the beauty and wonder of it all. Math is magnificent. I answered correctly. Gotta build up that riz. Because, you know, <laughs> it can go so much higher than six. I know, right? After school. Class is ended for today. Okay. It's a so, studious student. Yeah, very studious. Uh, yeah. So let's go to the first floor and talk to Mizuru. We're gonna get our reward oh. for our exam results. Ah, Yuki. I saw your exam results. Good work. Here, this is from the chairman. This is a reward for excellent, effectively balancing schoolwork as well as our extracurricular activities. Nice. A pendant of unity. Mm hmm. Let's take a look at that real quick. Gotta check it out. Shift boost. Okay. Nice. What is. A little situation. Oh, yeah, some yeah. uniform. Okay. All right. There you go. Okay. And yeah, go to the faculty office, of course. Mr. Oh, no. Oh, no, seems to have stepped out. I'm so surprised. Wow. <laughs> wow, how is it already so late? My darling's not home today, and I'm so lonely. Hmm, maybe I'll have dinner with Miss Toriyumi. We could go to the restaurant with that interesting game. What was it called again? A mahjong parlor? I hope I don't lose again, but I don't think there's any way I can win against Miss Toriyumi. Hi. Oh, hello, Yuki. How are you? Miss Toriyumi isn't here. I was just about to look for her myself, actually. Say, Yuki, do you play Mahjong? It's very intriguing. The technical terms in particular are very are quite interesting. If I play too much, I can't stop thinking about them for days. Mintan Pen Dora Dora Richi Ipatsu Chitotsu Tsubo 
I've said that stuff even in my sleep. My poor darling hasn't slept very well at least as a result. Shall I teach you the other technical terms? Though I'd just be repeating what Miss Toriyumi taught me. Well, for beginners, there's, on there's only Richie. And a few intermediate phrases such as, I got a reverse Adora, a reverse Dora. Look like you're waiting for one tile, or you've got have you gotta have more than two hand on. Oh, an event stuff. You have a hand, don't you? Have all the tiles you're waiting for and Manganbuya. So far, I've only had chance chances to use the beginner's phrases though. But Mr. Yumi is a very patient teacher. She'll tell me you should throw this one away, or you won't get any points if you call that one, so I wouldn't. And I dropped that tile by accident, so you can't run it. She's taught me so much that I haven't been able to win a single match. Sounds like she but might be cheating. cheating, yeah. Yeah. Learn technical terms for Mahjong. I don't know enough about Mahjong to know that for sure, but it sounds an awful lot like cheating. Yep, indeed. Me too. Mr. Ono doesn't seem to be returning. I decided to give up for today. If you know viewers, let us know in the comments. <laughs> All right. Okay. Now that that is done, practice. we are <laughs> going to do Lovers Rank 6. I'm going to go out on a limb and say I don't have a Lovers. Oh, I do. I have Titania. Perfect. Titania. The Queen of the Fairies. Yeah. Uh, classroom. What's up, Boo? Hey there. Oh, hey, Yuki Kuhn. Looks like we're finally done with exams. Ooh, we can finally relax now. Let's give ourselves a pat on the back and take a breather. Hey, about the other day. Sorry, um, do you have some time right now? I'd like to talk things out with you. Yeah, of course. Thanks. Then, can we go to the rooftop? Anything for you, Chica? Hey, do you remember when those guys stole my wallet and you came to help me? Yes. Um, sorry I got so mad at you. I was just frustrated. I don't like having to depend on other people, but it ended up happening anyway. You know, I couldn't say it at the time, but I'm actually glad you came. Maybe because it's you. So I want to thank you properly. Thanks for your help back then. I really appreciate it. Okay. Anytime. It was honestly kind of cool. Little baby, I know. Mikari <laughs> seems relieved to have gotten that off her chest. We appear to be growing even closer. Would you like another hug? <laughs> Oof, that's a big weight off my shoulders. Let's head back down. The roof doesn't get a lot of foot traffic, so I think it's a good place to have serious conversations. But couples tend to sneak up here too. If anyone sees us, the rumor mill might go crazy again. Wouldn't that be annoying? <laughs> you know, if people assumed we were dating. I wouldn't I mind. Wouldn't mind. <laughs> really? I'm not sure if you're being brave or oblivious. Still. That's something special about you. You don't get bogged down by what other people think. Uh-oh. They say a sneeze means someone's talking about you. Well, it's probably nothing. It's probably Junpei. Let's head on home, yeah? Yukari and I return to the dorm. Oh, welcome back. Hello. Your exams are over, right? If you decide to go to Tartarus, I want to go too. I promise I'll do everything I can. I'll be fighting for him too. Okay. So it's the evening. We're going to do Akihiko linked episode three. If you're free, can you spare a minute to help me out? I'm at Iwatoi Station. Let's go. Hey, bud. Go. Ah, there you are. I've actually finished my shopping already. You have some time now? I want your help for something. Yes. I owe you one. 
Thanks. Then let's head back to the dorm together. Ah, crap. I forgot to buy eggs. Sorry, but can you go back first to make sure no one uses the kitchen? I'll meet you there in a bit. Don't worry, I won't keep you waiting long. I'm quicker on my feet than you are, you know. <laughs> I don't know if that's true, actually, but... Looks like Snot isn't here yet. Sorry I'm late. I ran into some unexpected trouble. Of course you did. All right, here goes. Back me up, would you? I'm gonna make pancakes. Think you can help? Heck yeah. I guess you could say I've got a craving. I used to eat them all the time at the orphanage. I know they sell frozen ones nowadays, but nothing beats freshly cooked, right? Yeah, no kidding. They're easy to make too. <laughs> make me a lot. You think so? I just thought more would be better than less. Well, let's go on and get started. Okay, but with okay. that much uh, batter and eggs and milk. First. Yeah, uh, it's gonna be a lot of pancakes. What exactly do we do first? Oh, jeez. We're really big uh, pancakes. I, I think the recipe said to use lots of butter and to regulate the pan's temperature with a damp washcloth. Wait, we put a washcloth in the pan? Won't it burn? Bro. Please, let me handle it. You sure? <laughs> Thanks. I don't know how to cook anything besides the stuff I use for bodybuilding. I can break the eggs and mix the batter. I'll leave the actual cooking part to you. Oh, so that's how you use the washcloth. <laughs> how about we add some protein powder? <laughs> hey, don't look at me like that. Oh, <laughs> I'd better go get the plates. All yeah, right. you better. I think this will be enough. so many pancakes. Oh, check yeah. it out! That is a hilarious wow, amount of pancakes. Wow, look at all the pancakes! I knew something smelled good! Yeah, just give me a minute. We can eat once I bring them out. Would you mind getting everyone else? And don't forget Amada. Okay! Oh, it's like a Tartarus of pancakes! I know, right? Did the two of you make all of these yourselves? Yeah, although this guy was the one who cooked them. I said I had a hankering, but we might have made too much. I like pancakes, but no way I can eat all of these myself. If you guys could pitch in, that'd be great. So you like pancakes too, Sonata-san? Thank you. I can't wait to have some. I'll make some tea. I've got some leaves that'd be great for the occasion. It's pancake party time, as they say. Who, who says that, I guess? Thanks for the pancakes. They were really good. Tasted like a lot of care went into them. If you ever make some again, I'd like to help out too. For as many as we made, they sure did disappear fast. Cooking's not really one of my strong points. A certain someone would always say, if you pour protein powder on the ingredients, then you shouldn't be in the kitchen, dumbass. <laughs> Most of the time, I only ever got to watch someone else cook. So I never really learned myself. Anyways, thanks for helping out today. I'm hoping that cheered everyone up a little. You planned this from the start? What made you want to do this? They did things like this back when I was at the orphanage. I just wanted to recreate it. My sister used to cry all the time there. But the pancakes always brought a smile to her face. Mm. Hmm. Do you remember that medal you found in the package from my parents? My sister, Miki. She made that back when we were at the orphanage. Based on the letter that came with it, I guess my parents found it when they were cleaning. Miki was going to give that to me after we learned I was getting adopted out and leaving. But then that fire happened right after. And this metal was all that was left of her. Mm. Sounds like you two were close. Indeed. Apparently, Miki used to always say she wanted to thank me for being so strong and kind. She was really quiet, and she'd always be following me around. I don't really remember doing anything special for her. But I guess she was relying on me as her older brother. Seeing that medal made me think. 
Would my sister be proud of who I am now? Am I really strong and kind enough to deserve that medal? I think so. If I'm being honest, I don't really know what it means to be strong or kind. Everyone who's ever said that mm. to me has left without telling me the most important part. You saw how I was oh, today. This is all I'm capable of right now. I haven't grown at all since I was a kid. <laughs> They'd laugh if they saw me now. I seriously doubt it. I think you're plenty strong and kind, bro. Mm hmm. <laughs> I'm glad you feel that way, but I've still got a long way to go. I realized I'd just been running away all this time, making excuses about having my own problems. But from now on, I'm going to protect it all. We promised we'd become strong together. I won't let him down. Mm. I know you can do it, I think is going to be the best response here. Yeah, I agree. Well, if that's how you feel, then I better not disappoint. That's right. Step up, bro. <laughs> the point of this whole thing was to cheer everyone up. <laughs> and yet I'm the one getting supported here, you know? I think you're the kind of person my sister would have looked up to. All right. That's enough talking about the past. Let's hurry up and finish clean. <sighs> Are you hurt? Mm -hmm. What happened? What's wrong? Well, <clears throat> I ran into that group of punks on my way home from shopping today. There were even more from this time. And one guy managed to get a good hit in. Don't worry, though. I didn't do anything that would get me in trouble with the police. I just let them throw as many punches as they wanted until they got tired and gave up. Jeez, I dude. thought I could dodge them all, but uh, <laughs> I guess I've still got room to improve. Hmm. Finished cleaning up with Sonata and then went back to my room. Always room to improve. That's right. I feel like my charm has improved. Oh boy. Okay. We made it to the 20th. We did. All right, time for class. I know you've been busy lately, but you all remembered to do your homework, right? Just because you're not taking a humanities class next year doesn't mean you can blow off classic lit. Hey, are you all listening to me? <sighs> What's wrong, Fuka? You look kind of down. I haven't heard it from her in a while. Huh? Mm-hmm. Talk to me. What's bothering you? It's just... Aragaki-senpai. Oh. Yeah, it's pretty shocking. I'd never seen him in school, but he'd always be hanging around town. And now he's just... gone. It's hard to put it into words. I took it for granted that everyone would always be around. That nothing would ever change, but some things you can never get back. I didn't consider how easily it could happen. Once I realized that, I started thinking about my parents. I've sort of been avoiding the question, but is it okay for me to leave things with them like this? Parents, huh? Yeah, that's a tough one. But I think you'll work it out, Fuka. Moriyama, what are you waiting for? Come on up. Yeah, yeah. <sighs> Would it kill you to give your classmates a proper goodbye? Huh? What's going on? Hmm. Um, hi everyone. I know I haven't been here that long, but I feel like I've made some good friends. I'll remember each and every one of you after I transfer. Thank you all. How's that? Uh, wait, transfer? Failed to mention that, huh? What? Mm -hmm. What? You're a weird one, you know that? The biggest bitch in school is leaving and you're gonna miss her? You're transferring and you didn't say anything? It's not like it would have made a difference. 
Why make us both depressed? But yeah, my dad suddenly collapsed. Oh, jeez. And they say it'll take a while for him to recover because of some complications. We don't really have oh, that rough. much money, so we can't afford to stay in this area. Mm. <gasps> you know, now that I think about it, you're the only one who bothered being friends with a weirdo like me. But like I said before, we're both in the same boat. My parents act like I don't even exist. I hate living with them. That's why I was so oh. jealous when you moved into the dorm. Hmm. That's Kichan. You know, you've really changed, Fuka. You're a lot more cheerful now. But why'd you <laughs> move when your house is like right here? Huh? Well, um. If you don't want to say, that's okay. I'm sure you've got your reasons. But if it's something that you and your parents can work out, then do it while you have a chance. It'll be a while before my dad's in any condition for us to have a heart to heart. <laughs> Sage advice. <laughs> What am I mm -hmm. doing? This isn't what I wanted to talk about. You know, Fuka, I used to think every day was just the same depressing routine. And I'm only saying this because it's you, but you don't really get many second chances in life. Natsuki-chan. <sighs> I guess this is the last time I'll see this view. I won't be in school next week because I'll be packing, so I guess this is goodbye. No! Mm. <laughs> Don't you dare come see me off. I want to say goodbye on my own terms. No. <sighs> come on, don't give me that look. But you're leaving so suddenly. Hey, I'm sudden. not all broken up about this, just so you know. I've changed a lot since I met you. I'm gonna try and figure out what I really want to do with my life. I know you can do it, Natsuki-chan. <laughs> well, now I really feel like I gotta do it. No pressure, right? No. I got one last thing I want to say before I go. If you just accept the way things are, then you'll never move forward. Just like me. Interesting. So I hope you can figure out what you want to. What I want. It just depends on what I, you mean by accept uh, things as they are. Mm, I yeah. used to try and please everyone just to fit in. I was afraid of not being liked. So I always went along with the people around me. But I never really thought about what I wanted. <laughs> That's so you. Well, if they don't like you for who you are, I say screw them. But Amen, sister. I like you, Fuka. <laughs> Even if you hate yourself. Natsuki-chan. Well, I better get going. <gasps> That's probably the most honest conversation they ever had. Uh, Indeed. Natsuki-chan? Here, even if we're apart, we're still connected. So, we can always talk, right? Thanks for being my friend. Right. I'm kinda tearing up now. Natsuki-chan? Even if we're apart, we're still connected. <laughs> I get it now. Natsuki-chan, I'd always assumed my powers were a reflection of my faults. I was always worried about how other people see me, and that's why my powers let me see others. But I guess there is something I want after all. Seeing everyone getting along and working together makes me so happy. So I want us to treasure this forever. I have the power to connect people. Even when they're apart, my persona has given me this amazing gift. The friendship I've always wanted. Another fundamental shift in personality. So, second evolution. Oh, that's interesting. Resolution of Fuka's heart has awakened a new persona. 
Lucia has given rise to Juno. It's not a massive difference. That's interesting. All right. Love that. Revelation grants one random enhanced positive effect to all allies. Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, that's there what it's always are. been. Right? Oh, um, what are you all doing here? It is unusual so. to find you up on the rooftop. Well, so... Well, we didn't see you around, so... I'm yeah, it was sure Oracle. All right. So it's an enhanced positive effect. It it's better. Gotcha. Oh. So it is still her okay. second theurg, but I'm pretty sure hers replaces I've made her up my first mind. One. I think so too. I'm going to do everything I can with the power I've been given. This is what I've decided I want to do. Um, sure. <laughs> Sorry, I guess <laughs> that was out of nowhere, wasn't it? Uh, you sure you're all right? <laughs> She's fine, Junpei. Go take care of yourself. It's fine. All right, and we are definitely at our time for today. So that's right. Thank you so much for joining us. Uh, I guess it's back to stare daggers into our soul. Mm -hmm, What's up, girl? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. How you doing? Anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, like I said, thank you so much for joining us. We hope you've really enjoyed it. I know we've been enjoying the story, and uh, yeah, lots to unpack there that I just. Uh, didn't want to divest or diverge too much from but if there's anything you feel like sharing in the comments please do whether it's your thoughts on things that were shared or topics that were covered unrelated to the game whatsoever or anything else in between it doesn't really matter we just love having you communicate with us so we can engage with you because we want to be part of your lives as much as you're part of ours uh, and if you right. do like what you watch please like subscribe share with a friend all of that it helps us out tremendously and if you're looking for something to fill in your time after this episode, maybe you're all caught up with Persona, check out all their stuff. We've got, you know, Legend of Zelda, Wind Waker. We've got Skies of Arcadia, Xenogears. We've got Coffee Talk if you need something a little more chill. Little Kitty Big City. Um, we also did Unpacking, and we're working through Mika and the Witch's Mountain, ongoing series of Liza P and Salt and Sanctuary. And the list just continues as we continue to, you know, play and complete games so bound to find something that you'll like i'm sure and indeed yeah. but it, many options <laughs> yes <laughs> lots of options uh, especially the co-op if you want to have a good time laughing at our suffering salt and sanctuary is <laughs> where it's at so um we'll just put it mildly we are not great at platformers apparently so <laughs> lots of plummeting to our our demise but more than anything, we are just so grateful that you are here with us and that you have let us be a part of your day. And we hope it is a wonderful one. But until then, we will see you all in the next video. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye now. Diddly diddly do 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 do. Thanks for watching.